let's say they fund 100 companies, one of them might be a Google or a YouTube. 10 of them might be successful and profitable. 90% of them fail. You don't know which of those 100 is going to be the YouTube. You have to make money, right? That's why it's a company. Stage is happening and it will be happening from one more of those startups. Have ever even make money. That's tough. Our goal is global transparency and openness for the economic, you know, commercial, commercial peaceful use of this kind of technology. Ports, mines, cities, roads, buildings. We analyze a lot of imagery, not just visible imagery, but thermal imagery, SAR. We announced a thousand satellite launch contract with Thumbsat. Communications to earth sensing, to research, and all the way into military applications. We regard satellite launch as basically package delivery. It's a very big market. Federal Express does most, has built their business on the backbone of that. Yeah. Okay. Um, that's what we do. If you look at the number of satellites that have been launched, imaging satellites in the past two, three years, it's more than in the previous like 20 years all put together. We're just really at the beginning of the journey. It's very early. I mean, it's 2017, but in this industry, commercializing this industry is very, very early. There's a market niche. No one else is going for this particular niche. We are. Yeah. Mistaken business, I think, is that they go after business niches that are already being attacked. Um, there, are, oh, there are already solutions for it. Yeah. There's an old, old phrase, nature abhors a vacuum. Okay, well, business abhors a vacuum too. So if you find a vacant niche, that's an opportunity. Take the opportunity. We're trying to keep everything simple about how we do it. Our air launch platform is a 1960s fighter jet. Every flight hour for that military jet costs me $40,000. The difference between 40 and 18 is huge. Yeah. That's 10% of our total cost yeah. right there. Building to most cost-effective solutions is very important for us. It's about cost efficiencies. Yeah. The national statistics are non-existent. They don't exist. Oh, we make the national statistic. We usually make our own independent analysis. Independent of the national bank. That's the whole point. SpaceX and they're building a reusable launcher. How many times did they fail? But here's the thing. They kept they weren't afraid of failure, so they kept doing it. it used to be uh, the cost of launch was so huge that companies were literally afraid of failure. Yeah. Um, that's why you didn't see so many things. Now you got these CubeSats coming along with small launch costs a year or so, and if it fails, well, guess what? You just launch another one. They're not just not afraid of it. Yeah. They're making it a point of pride. See, we messed up, but we got better. Mm -hmm. That's the mindset you have to have. Silicon Valley has really become a new hotbed, an epicenter for new space industry. New entrants onto the market, people that own satellites, that create satellites, people that analyze the information. And we're together, all of us creating an ecosystem. Concentration of people, concentration of companies, concentration of capital. When all of that comes together, it's really cool.